Oh, Mr. J, I'm going fishing and I'm in need of a cork. Yeah, because you popped yours a long time ago, Ben. <laughs> do you have one I can borrow? No, but if we did, what would you do with it? Oh, I find that a cork is marvelous for my flies. Oh, why don't you just use zippers like everybody else? <laughs> Oh, no, no, I mean uh, trout flies, trout flies like this little beauty here. Oh, yeah. Where are you going fishing, Ben? Well, I have this friend who has his own plane. Oh, you're going to have to fly and fish. <laughs> oh, that's droll, Mr. J. No, we're going up to Vermont for the weekend. Uh -huh. To get there and back in time, we have to fly. Oh, sounds great. Well, I got to get to work. Ah, flying is the only way to go. That exhilarating moment when one is suddenly airborne, able to pierce the clouds, the wonderful feeling of looking down at the birds. Yeah, it's a hell of a lot safer than looking up at them. <laughs> oh, there's nothing like flying. Uh, I know. I saw a lot of flying while I was in the service. Oh, then you know the feeling. No, I said I saw a lot of flying. I never did it. Where'd your friend learn to fly in the service? No, uh, one day he wandered into a flight school in Flushing and he got his pilot's license in just a few short months. You mean that's all it takes, a few months? Uh, that in seventeen hundred dollars. Uh, you mean if I walked in there and plunked seventeen hundred dollars down on the table, they'd teach me how to fly a plane? Certainly. Mm. That sure sounds like fun. Wish I had the time to do it. Oh, lots of successful businessmen are making the time. They're all taking up flying as a hobby. <coughs> hey, Bentley, I just got a great idea. I'm gonna take up flying as a hobby. <laughs> I say that is a good idea. Oh, that's why you gotta get up to Vermont. Shame you in such a hurry. Uh, well, thank you, Mr. J. I completely forgot about the time. My goodness, standing here chatting. Weezy! <laughs> Weezy! What is it, George? When you write, you are really right. Mwah. Oh, <laughs> thank you. What was I right about? About me taking a hobby. I'm going to do it. That's perfect. What did you decide on? Off we go into the wild blue yonder. You're going to take up singing. <laughs> No, flying. Flying what? An airplane, you know. Mm. <laughs> well, where did you get a crazy idea like that? From Bentley. He put the B in my bonnet. Mm. <laughs> it looks mm. more like bats in your belfry. <laughs> Talking about flying's a great sport. For pigeons, not for my husband. Wait a minute. You said you wanted me to take up a hobby, didn't you? Suicide is not a hobby. Oh, get out of here. Look, flying is real safe nowadays. What about all those private plane crashes you read about? What about all those car accidents you read about? <laughs> well, that's different. How? I don't know, but I just don't want you to fly. Look, Wheezy, flying is something I've always wanted to do. Ever since I was in the Navy on an aircraft carrier. I used to always be jealous of the flyboys. The whole crew used to look up at them and down on me. <laughs> well, why would the crew look down on you? Because I was five decks below peeling potatoes. <laughs> and you are still jealous of the pilots after all these years? There's just some things you never get over, Weezy. Like, I'm still mad at those kids in school who used to hang my coat on a top nail in the clothes closet. What was wrong with that? I was still in it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a long time ago. You're not a kid anymore. You're a married man now with responsibilities. Besides, you're too old to start flying. No, I ain't. I'm just as young as I ever was. But, George... No, I... but nothing. Weezy. Look, a man has got to do what he's got to do, and being up there in the wild blue yonder is what I got to do. Well, who do you think you are? John Wayne? <laughs> no, George Jefferson. I don't like nobody bossing me around, and that goes for my wife, too. Now, I'm telling you, I don't want to hear no more about it. Uh, now, wait a Not minute. Not another word. Well, don't you boss me around, either. I ain't bossing you around. I'm telling you what to do. <laughs> If you... No think... more talking. Look, I'm going flying. That's it. Uh, George, wait. You can't. Why not? Uh, because you said you had to work today, remember? Work, Wheezy. Is that all you think of is work, work, work? <laughs> Look, now, I'm taking flying lessons, and that's it. But, George, it's dangerous. How can you be so selfish? Selfish? Me selfish? I'm not the one that's selfish. You the one that's being selfish? You trying to stop me from doing something I want to do? Look, if I want to take a chance on spilling my blood, it's my business. Well, half of your blood is mine, and I want to keep my half in your body, and I forbid you to go. What? You forbid me? Ha! Now that did it. Just for that, I'm going whether I want to or not. <laughs> well, go ahead and see if I care. Flushing Airport, here I come, over and out. 